Well, traders, Samurai Trader here. Welcome to session 56 How to Day Trade Any Market, the $1,000 a day challenge. Now, if you're a young gun, 1000 a day may not be enough for you, so then, therefore, you only just need to increase the your position size, add more contracts. Now, traders, what I cover in today's session, you can apply to any market, whether you trade futures, forex, or stocks. Also, you'll see me using Renko charts here. You can apply the exact same concepts to tick charts, to time-based charts, uh, to range, at volume. It really doesn't matter. I love uh, Renko because they smooth out price action, but I do regularly refer to tick charts because as much as Renko is great, it does remove some valuable information at times such as re-entry opportunities but we we'll see if I remember to talk about that as we get into it so as always I do need to pull up the disclaimer there is a risk in trading please feel free to pause the recording to read the disclaimer don't trade with money that you can't afford to lose here now uh, I've got a uh, I've actually recorded this a couple of days ago a live trading session where you can watch me execute I think it was four out of four I had um, where I entered and I'm explaining why I took the trade etc etc now I haven't finished um, uh, preparing it that is I've got to prepare the slides and a couple other things to go with it however if you register for my free ebook which will just be down below uh, on the next slide here I'll send you will automatically receive the invitation it's a webinar on demand so when you receive the invitation you'll be able to click on it and watch the webinar it only goes for about I think 30 minutes but you'll see me fire off four or five trades I think it was four trades and I explained the reasoning behind those uh, where I got out where I got in why I did that etc so it was on the run so um, just good for you to uh, see and get an idea of what it's like to trade live so request uh, my ebook if you're not already a member and of course your members watching this you would have already received received the uh, uh, a link to the video by the way if you are a member but if you're not a member or if you haven't downloaded you're not on my database please um, click on the link below to get my ebook and you'll get the invitation in the next um, well number of days traders I love this quote by Tony Robbins success leaves clues long ago I realized that success leaves clues and people who produce outstanding results do specific things to create those results I believe that if I precisely duplicated the actions of others I could reproduce the same quality of results that they had that's what I've done I've been day trading now for 28 years most of you or for those members watching this now I have a massive library I've been following got some great traders work with some great traders and so <clears throat> this is what basically I followed so what you're learning in my sessions is trading strategies and techniques from traders that have also been trading for many many years strategies that are battle proven okay they're proven to work they're pattern based and they're mechanical in their nature and very importantly rules based now if you're not already a member a very quick advertisement what I show you here today for $197 you can come and join me as a trader okay become a member um, and one thing I did want to show you here um, I think traders think I might be exaggerating as an example there's now over 36 powerpoints for various strategies that I've discovered over the years or modeled like trading divergence the t3 which kicks butt uh, members the, the big dipper from one of our members that that was put together by one of our members um, and uh, pivot magnet trades um, <laughs> there's just so many powerpoints here and videos that go along with just about uh, all of them so traders literally it is the most comprehensive trading program in the world it literally is I challenge you to show me anything more comprehensive um, between what you actually receive there are um, dozens and dozens of handouts PDFs folders for you to go into etc now the good news is you also don't have to study them all 
okay you only want to start off with the top two strategies that I teach you and then you expand from there and also within the 197 uh, I'm also giving away eight live coaching sessions where you can attend my private group coaching sessions eight sessions um, uh, are included uh, if you can't attend live they are recorded and if you wish to continue after the first month drop me an email it's $97 a month if you wish to sign up thereafter end of advertisement but make sure you download the video to watch my live trading so what have I got in today's sessions four trades for four wins in 60 minutes of trading once again scalping and the scalp and run technique that is I love to get in and get out now with that being said uh, I did go for a larger target which I was regretting it and I'll explain that when I get to the charts in a moment look with with scalping you have generally have a smaller stop loss you're in and out in and out I love to hear the cash register ring and so when you're trailing uh, you know you you'll get it pulls back and goes up pulls back and you know I that's not my personality I love to get in and I uh, get out get in get out get in that's my technique reminds me of Marty Swartz the pit bull okay Marty's 78 now but you know typically earn 500 800,000 a month working from home scalping the ES and a few other markets he uh, on the ES he actually now mainly trades uh, options and um, as Marty says just about anyone can do this if you're willing to put the work in that is you can't be merely interested in day trading you've got to be committed but the great thing is there are rules based strategies that kicks butt kick butts so my goals a thousand dollars a day so here we ended up after commissions a net um, 161 so gross then after commissions just there it was in 60 minutes of trading I could have actually finished quicker than that a couple of trades I didn't take which I will explain now just over here and I'll go back we'll go to the live charts in a moment but this is a trade where I went for a larger target and for any members watching this I had a 2d t3 on the anchor chart one so I thought I'll really take this down way down here and pick up a nice big seven eight hundred dollar move but it come down and I would have been out with my 14 ticks down here and actually went to break even hit my but ticks but I then lifted my stop back up which was just up one tick above and we bummed around here and finally I got filled for me I just should have got out and I could have taken this one here or even this one okay which would have given me even a better return anyway so I really prefer to scalp okay um, and we'll look at these um, when we get to the charts in more details because there's some great lessons I want to teach you there now as always most of you know you start off with just $200 a day now if you're trading during the New York hours uh, your target would be four to six hundred if if not more and the reason being when we trade during the New York hours I don't trade the New York hours by the way uh, I'm down under in Australia at the moment and so I prefer to trade in the afternoon my time which is very early morning um, uh, US time where most of my members are located so what that means is you're going to actually um, trade a higher time frame therefore you need a larger stop loss and we'd go for a larger target it's all relevant and so down here if I average 200 a day and I start off with three and a half thousand in my account and I just start trading additional contract and yes if you've seen this I know I show this every slide or every uh, session I do this is the true income potential okay now if you don't have that sort of money you start on the micros so as an example and I will show you this spreadsheet if you start uh, on the micro say if you're going to trade now I'm trading the four tick on the micro NQ which is even lower than that one you only need 350 to 400 dollars if you're trading during New York hours you need to be trading probably an average of a 12 tick what that means is on the micro you need around $900 and that's about $9,000 on the big contract what that means ultimately I can have a stop loss of $180 it is all relevant it's a bit beyond 
this seminar or this um, webinar for me to go into it with you but the bottom line is money management rules you break you your money management rules and you're going to get smashed that is the bottom line and you know unfortunately you know everyone wants to get rich quick that's not the reality in this business get rich slowly that's the reality money management is king if you want to be here with me in three or four years time trading away follow your management money management rules if you don't have the capital for an example if you're trading the two tick you don't have five thousand you start on the micro and here's the bottom line if you do that if you start on the micro with only three hundred and fifty dollars in 11 weeks on twenty dollars a day twenty bucks a day okay you've now got in your account four thousand four hundred now you can start trading the big contract and there's other benefits there such as gaining experience etc etc on the way through and once you're there you then switch over and start trading the big contract why do I re-emphasize this in every single video I do because everyone sold on the get rich quick ideas in trading futures Forex you know 99% oh actually that's an exaggeration 90% of people that I deal with or, or email me they have these grand ideas that you know you can be risking five to ten percent no problems and it's even five percent is suicide traders it really is because 90% of trading is head stuff it truly is anyway moving right along if you start off with a small account within 22 weeks you're back up to earning the big bucks the 10 grand potentially in that time anyway time is going to pass either way if you want to um, have financial freedom and be able to trade the rest of your life from home and as you see nearly every one of my videos uh, I'm finished wrapped up in an hour now I do have to clarify something there when I say I'm wrapped up in an hour you need to allow an hour of prep time checking things out on the charts going through um, because it is a, a pattern solving exercise reviewing your trading rules getting things ready all right so to just to say for me to say look you're in and out 20 because a lot of my videos I'm wrapped up in 20 minutes to 30 minutes usually and so that you need to add a good hour or so on to that okay and what I say to day traders is depending on time of day if you're a serious day trader three hours a day is your commitment you can't merely be interested in trading you've got to be committed to trading okay so let's move on so traders as always I'll be talking about pivot levels open high low and close levels the major EMAs our intraday swing highs and lows because we bounce off those and the current days high and lows we won't worry about round numbers in this session so how do we do it how do we achieve this sort of target or of course much greater depending on the time of day um, so sometimes I'll receive an email from someone and say look yeah I'd love to see you do that during New York and you're absolutely correct I could not trade the four tick during New York hours it's too fast so traders will ask me regularly what's the right time frame to be trading my answer is whichever one is tradable okay that is um, you'll have different uh, time frames uh, for different markets busier times and others if that makes sense all right and just one thing I did want to quickly show you is that with any market whether you heard of the ES the Nasdaq the the Russell the YM even oil now um, they've now got micro contracts and so it's now uh, even better than trading Forex minis and micros um, and the reason being is you're paying with most reputable brokers a fixed commission there are no spreads uh, it's a fair market there's no stop running there's no a B books etc with that being said if you still prefer Forex and that's what I started out in um, or that's what I used to specialize in years ago um, stick with that if that's your um, uh, the market you prefer but there are just so many different markets traders okay so of course is I train uh, my traders in the what I believe to be the best markets are I just wanted to throw that in let's get to the charts anyway look let's start from here um, 
so this is uh, midnight central standard time and if we go back this is tons of opportunities um, uh, if you get home from work and say if you're based US based, you get home the market opens up at um, uh, 5 p.m. Central Standard Time reopens and there's always a ton of opportunities particularly after about 8 p.m. Eastern by the way and the reason the market really picks up after 8 p.m. Eastern is you've had the Tokyo market is open and so Shanghai okay so it can be a bit sketchy the first couple of hours it can be a bit quiet but then it tends to uh, pick way up so let's start from here so this uh, my time by the way is, is generally um, around 4 p.m. 3 to 4 p.m. around 4 p.m. my time so it really suits me all right so up here for members watching this we've got our classic t3 just a no-brainer okay and down we come then we get a 2b and so we're going to lead into the setups traders that I actually took but um, I just want to show you some other um, what I call plain vanilla uh, entries now this is a setup here that there's two setups that are absolutely key um, when you start and to master and this is actually these two setups are all you need the rest of your life is a 2b and a 2bd and a 34b they're both trend following strategies oh, that's a 34 just there so this is a 2b and these are very mechanical in nature now the only way you're not going to be able to trade this is if it's too fast which means you're trading the wrong time frame so people say oh yeah it's all right after the fact well see the white paint bar have you got the white paint bar the super scalper yes well you've got a trade do you have a trend uh, so anyway up we go and this lime green line here this is the high of day so up we go 34b thank you very much this is by the way what we call grinding when we're like this this is not I don't like this I don't jump in on these but in fact you've got um, I call them ruler ones you've got a few other potential entries well what I do have is a really nice potential divergence setting up and this is what I call angulation uh, a term I got from the late um, Bill Williams uh, he would call it um, angulation where uh, you're angling away strongly and it's basically like a t3 it's a mean reversion trade so up we come here is my first trade of day I had some great divergence and this is also the one traders that I took whereby I um, wish I had have just taken my usual target oops and excuse the spelling error just there it's meant to say target the AC 134 EMA so here I jumped in on this one and the reason I've been trying to get larger uh, targets is I'm a scalper at heart in out in out but at times I look say for an example just here that there is worth 10 20 30 40 that's a 300 dollar move each one of these steps okay so these are called Renko candles each candle from the height of a low is worth um, $20 but each half candle that as you stair step up or stair step down they're worth $10 each on this market or it'd be um, $1 on the micros so you can do you know go and pick it and that's your a home run for the day particularly when you look at your capital required you've only got a little stop loss so I place my stop loss just under these little swing lows or above the swing high so these are home runs so I try to go for larger targets but what actually happens here is like I would have been out with my 14 16 ticks just here uh, but I went, lifted my stop back up looking for a larger move it pulls back then it finally gets down all right and this is a lot of heat now that's only by the way it seems like forever that was over 18 minutes all right now some may say only 18 minutes but for me where well, I'm in and out within you know one or two minutes it seems like forever so going for larger targets uh, I've, I'll show you a few more videos you'll see where I've gone for that but I really prefer to scalp okay so I got out there um, so target <laughs> it's meant to be target there so that was um, uh, trade one still a nice little um, uh, winner just there now as we come down here 
uh, I'm now looking for a retracement now follow the gold okay so see my gold EMA I want you to remember follow the gold so up here now I'm about to get trade two. I want you to notice my long-term stochastic is oversold and I'm about to get a hook and this is actually called a 2b now in taking this one whenever I take these see this down here this is a 200 EMA we usually get at least one bounce off that now as a scalper what I will do and it's not always the right thing to do well I still think it's the right thing but it doesn't always uh, it doesn't always work out as I think it's going to work out I'll usually exit and in this case I covered the trade I got out here um, I didn't get my full ticks but got the cash register ringing why because we quite often will bounce that's why off that so I covered it for 200 uh, but that's what I'd normally do and do you know what it works for me but then we come down for trade number three now trade number three is what I call a t12 so a t12 is a very high probability trade and for members watching this this was um, uh, a t12 just down here um, off the anchor chart one okay so I took that there now in taking this trade I took in taking this trade I want you to look up here what's my trend direction now well without looking at higher time frames it certainly looks like we're starting to trend down in fact you can see virtually all of my EMAs are rolling over and trending down okay at least on the entry chart now the reason that's important if I take a trade here I'm going to be generally buying straight into resistance up here because we're in a downtrend okay so I'll usually cover my trades up here and get out now this one I covered at the 200 so it should be over there so I'll usually exit here and that usually works out well for me so as we come up and with this one uh, I had quite a late entry I entered this basically uh, on this one with my stop just down below here it's basically for members watching this basically it's set up as a t10 okay we rally up and I got out here and in fact I ended up with two ticks of slippage on this and this is one thing if I didn't mention this you have probably heard this on my other videos with the NQ you because it's not huge volume after hours you'll get slippage a great deal 80 90 percent of your trades if you trade in oil maybe 50 percent of a trade the ES nowhere near as much you've got greater volume why trade the NQ then you've got great volatility compared to just about any other market out there okay but it can be a wild beast at times so when do you stop trading this or when do you increase the time frame when it gets too fast now just here I've got a potential short so I'm out here I've covered the trade I'm out I got a couple of tick slippage and for members watching this we had a classic 2b okay now we'd already tested the 200 and woulda coulda shoulda and the reason I didn't take that I had major support just under I had the AC 189 down here and I didn't take it and it popped okay now um, Dick Diamond who's written the book um, uh, he's from Florida he, he the, the quote he says all the time is if it's not an 80 20 trade he's an educator as well by the way but he says um, look if it's not an 80 20 20 trade 80% potential winner I'm not going to take it selling into when you're right on a pivot selling right into a pivot or a major EMA or the open high low or close is not an 80 20 trade it's a much higher risk trade now this is a bounce here's a, a classic example this is a trade entry where I'm bouncing off a higher time frame so here the reason I didn't take that is I'd be selling into and potentially bouncing but instead it went straight through now down here that white line that's the prior day's close that acts like a price magnet or a pivot it also offers major and this is my fourth trade here 
major support resistance now just here for members watching this we had a classic t3 just there okay so we had a classic t3 and I sort of hesitated because it was quite a strong move but then I had a little t10 set up went sideways and then I decided to take this one thank you very much got up there I hit my 14.6 and covered was out of the trade so just there that was uh, four trades four wins in 60 minutes a couple of trades I didn't take look what could have should have but the fact is it wasn't an 80 20 now straight after that okay so that was 60 minutes four trades for four wins so the markets can be very forgiving when you don't take trades when you make mistakes provided overall we follow our trading rules and the, and the statistics once again in trading there's no certainties there's only probabilities and this is where traders need to learn to think and trade like a casino let me say that again to think and trade like a casino now I come here and this is live now so let's look at this right now okay just just here we had a standard t3 up here for members watching this that's your standard t3 what's that just there that's a t20-1 um, r3b just your classic you had one up there and you had one there now look what happened you sold down into or you would have sold straight down into the prior days close so traders these are all rules and they kick butt and these are all patterns now there was and I'd finished wrapped up my trading but straight after for, there was a 2b a trend following you then had a little divergence trade there there was then another short opportunity that was actually a 2b you had it we still would have been in that one as you can see here we're bouncing now you still consider those now because you've still got a great downtrend now I want you to notice just under here what you actually had was a pivot uh, and the low of day it's hard for you to see that that cyan line that's the low of day so what you've got down here is a pivot you've got double support resistance there now it's okay to sell into that when you're up there you've got room to make a profit but with this potential trade if we had a sold there you're selling right at major support in this case so this is where you've got to be very careful and then it turned into a little double bottom with divergence now what about this one here we're bouncing and this is a 2b and we've got distance down here to the confluence here of support now that little hot pink line you can see there that is the um, prior days low so what you've got here is a basically a whole zone here of support resistance down here now if you had have taken that trade you were still mighty fine and it turned into a bet the farm so any members watching this you've got a bet the farm right there and then we pop down and we retest or well actually we re we form a new low low and we test right there the um, uh, the prior days low and we get our classic t10 long and another to be short now each one of these trades are pattern based as Mark Douglas in his book the discipline trader states if you want to master the art of day trading find a strategy that's not mathematical based that is pattern based that repeats on a daily basis all of these are patterns that we're looking for so traders um, I'll wrap this video up so see another good day you know I can give you all of the setups what you need though is to follow the money management rules of course and then to get the screen time I'll give you the strategies you need the screen time now as a quick reminder make sure by the way you subscribe to my channel to be kept up to date with all of my videos uh, make sure you request my ebook so you'll get the link then to the live recorded webinar which you can watch at any time um, where I'm going to do it is what I call they call it an on-demand video so rather than waiting you can watch it straight away better still become a member $197 
uh, you get everything I've been showing you here uh, that is all my indicators and you can set this up on any trading platform I want to say that I should just qualify that some brokers have platforms or charting packages which which are free but they limit you in really some of the things you can do so you do need to make sure you've got the right charting package and when you're ready to go part-time full-time if I can call it that way you would need to really have something like ninja trader or trade station my really ninja trader to me is really the number one platform and their support is unbelievable okay so ninja trader is really the way to go and don't forget also I'm going to give you eight of my two-hour sessions if you can't attend live and in each of those sessions and just on that if you are interested I'll just show you this just as a matter of interest okay so let me just quickly uh, pull this up uh, where are we here coaching handouts I've been running these for years okay these coaching sessions and so in the coaching sessions uh, I run eight sessions a month and in every session there are handouts there are powerpoints uh, we're going through the powerpoints we usually spend about an hour going through handout we never ever get to them all but we color income targets we go through the cheat sheets and then the last hour we go through um, candle by candle from the right hand side how we trade uh, and I forgot to mention I also run I've got a live trading room as well which I've got a couple of hundred members in my live trading room but anyway uh, traders I'll see you what session was this <laughs> let me go back so uh, this was um, session 56 I look forward to seeing you in one of my coaching classes as a member thanks traders cheers